Kolkata's much and eagerly awaited encounter with celebrated British playwright, screenwriter, filmmaker, novelist Hanif Qureshi. The ape, let's give him a big hand. With all of you, we are very excited to listen to these conversations. We have been partnering with AKLF over the past few years. Harry Johnson gazed out of the train window at the genteel English countryside and he almost wept. If the newspapers were right, Britain was a crowded island, teeming with busy immigrants. Many were clinging to the sides, as on a little boat about to capsize. Meanwhile, everyone on board was so close together they were beginning to turn on one another like trapped animals, particularly since the financial crash. This is the last word, and uh, let's just talk about uh, this book for a few minutes. Well, I, I remember London in the 70s, and I remember thinking it was um, the most racist society I'd ever been to. Um, and today, when I, when I go to London, I'm really astonished at the, at the changes that have occurred in about 40 years. And I think it's true to say that it might be the first um, genuinely multicultural society. And I'm speaking about London, not the entirety of uh, Britain. Uh, I think it's absolutely right to say that London is a kind of a almost, you get the feeling that there was a kind of a social experiment at work and uh, it happens from the minute you arrive at Heathrow, you get a sense that people were told they were not allowed to uh, have babies with other people from the same ethnicity, they were not allowed to or something. It's a, it's a kind of a social experiment at work and it's, uh, it's, a, it's a, a beautiful and astonishing thing to see and I would love to see how that plays out uh, in the future.